I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Alita Loresco with your need to know weather on this Friday. We've got a cool front moving in, but not after temperatures warm into the upper 80s to low 90s out ahead of that front. Today, we're not challenging any records, but it will be on the toasty side as the humidity increases and those onshore winds may trigger a spotty rain shower. The chance that you get a shower today will be less than 20%. You'll notice the frontal boundary doesn't quite make it into Houston this afternoon, but late in the afternoon into the evening is when we anticipate uh, a few light rain showers along that front to move into the Houston area. Potentially around 10 p.m. is when the front moves through along I-10 and then along the coastline around midnight, a few spotty rain showers there, and then overnight those clouds should continue to push offshore. I'm thinking by sunrise there could still be some clouds along the coastline, but areas north of I-10 will see some rapid clearing, and we've got a beautiful forecast lined up for you this weekend. Now, for those of you that might be headed out towards San Antonio or Corpus Christi to check out the uh, annular solar eclipse, know that there are some clouds out there. Uh, speaking of the eclipse, here's a timeline for you. Partial eclipse begins here in Houston just before 1030 at 1027 a.m. At 1158 a.m. is the maximum eclipse, then followed by the partial eclipse, which ends uh, 138 p.m. Again, the best chance of seeing the total uh, annular eclipse will be further out west around San Antonio and the Corpus Christi area. And you can see, as I mentioned, that future track is showing maybe even a few spotty rain showers just to the west of Corpus, uh, but could be dealing with a little bit of cloud cover and that may obscure your view. Otherwise, a gorgeous weekend and the beautiful conditions, weather conditions are gonna continue through the middle part of next week with rain in the forecast returning uh, around Thursday as our next frontal boundary approaches the area. All right, that's a look at your forecast on this Friday. Thanks for watching.